My name is Onika McKnight. I'm a worker at Philadelphia International Airport, and I've been working it down for six years. I started making seven dollars an hour, and I still make seven dollars an hour. The contracting workers are not looking for a bailout. We're not looking for a handout. We're not looking for a get rich quick scheme. We're simply asking to not live in poverty if we're working full time. Councilman Squilla. Aye. Councilwoman Tasco. Council President Clark. Aye. This is going to the back. And so now it's about letting the people decide. proves that people power does exist. And once you bring people together, you're going to get results. Somebody said, well, it's the people power. It's people power, but it's people of faith. Mm -hmm. Because people of faith know if I keep doing the things that I'm led to do by the spirit that leads me, the doors will open that I can't even see. And so let's, let's just keep doing it. Let's keep believing, let's keep hoping, let's keep praying, let's keep standing, and, and watch the great things that uh, God will do through us. Well, it was in And when the people speak in men, we are very clear that they'll speak with a strong authority. Yes. And it won't be a vote 51 to 49, yeah. but it'll be a vote where the overwhelming people of this city speak strongly for a living wage, that will speak through the council chambers, speak to the mayor's right. office, right. the living wage should be the standard for every contractor and subcontractor in this city. It will be closer to having a city of opportunity that works for all.